Heyo, Thallion here, and welcome back to Pocket Mirror. We are in Cerberus, where apparently there are dogs everywhere. That's all it was doing was barking at us, but hopefully we can press on into the underworld. Should I be worried? Oh, hi, Lisette. Hi. Look who's to visit Lisette. Oh, crap. I don't know. Can I move? Can I go? What are you so scared of, hmm? Lisette. Uh, did what? Are you dragging her by chain? Is it this, perhaps? <laughs> she looks so creepy like she got them drugs. Lisette, no. Oh, jeez, is she killing all of her clones? What? Or is she breaking all the mirrors? It's no use feign feigning ignorance, Missy. You know what you did. Lisette, please. <clears throat> Lisette, please. Please, let oh, no, you listen. Oh, God. Isn't this what you've always wanted? There's nothing to be ashamed of, Missy. Can you just say my name? Please give me my name, Lisette. It's no secret what you did to poor Lisette, is it now? No, Lisette, I just... There's that bad habit of yours again, Missy. Uh-huh. Wait, I didn't notice. Her name is Bitch there. Wait, why is her name Bitch? I... <laughs> why is her name Bitch? That's really fucked. Lisette, what is it now, Lisette? Oh. In my pocket mirror. No, I can't, Lisette. Oh, what in the world? She wants the mirror, Missy. Why was she named Bitch? <laughs> what? Oh, man, I can't take this seriously now. What can you give us, then? I can give you... Oh, what have you given to poor Lisette? Hmm? Pocket mirror. She's Bitch again. Oh? So you do know the answer. What? What are you talking about? I am so confused right there. Mirror. Lisette, no, it's like slow poke. It's like, slow. <laughs> Come on, Lisette's hungry. I would rather not. Can we leave now? Can we go? I want to go in the other direction. The back direction. You have something I want. So what should I feed her? Um, can we just give me what I want? Can I just know? Give her the pocket. Give her something else. <gasps> I'm gonna give her the candy cane. Finally, it rears its beautiful head and shows me what- Take the candy cane! Yes! What is this? I- I want to help you, not hurt you! Help me? Yes, Lisette, I- Aw, oh, crap. Oh, I live! I thought I died. I thought I would be a done dead. Hello, Lisette! Okay, well, I mean, I'm alive. That's- that's a broken mirror. That is a done-done broken mirror. But at least we didn't die to the creepy Lisette monster named Bitch. Why was she named Bitch? Okay, can we leave now? Thanks, bye! It was nice knowing you, bye! Of course, we're not in the place where we meant to start. Um, okay, there's those posters over there. Man, this place is weird. Is there's like this weird, like, ring, like, Barnum Brothers, like, what the fuck just- Did- did I just- did I just teleport? Did I just do the teleporter, Rooney? Is this the- what is this? What the hell? Endless hole. What? Is there a hole in the wall? Is there a way I could- Whoa, what was that? Wait, did the door change? Hi! Did I- did I figure something out or did I do something poorly? Welcome! Is it like- is it the boy inviting me in again? Do I get to see Lisette's theater? Is that what it has become? Okay, no, apparently not. Bye- who are you? What is that? Lisette? What- what are you? What is that? What is that character model? Lisette. Oh, she's walking upside down. Oh, the, the the room is flipped upside down. Lisette, can you hear me? Oh, yeah, we can break through to her. Come on, break it. Or is that not good? I thought that might be good that we were breaking through to her, but apparently not. Oh, am I supposed to follow Lisette? Bye. Nice knowing you, I guess. I don't know what. Oh, no, not an endless room again. Well, bye. Can we not break the mirror? I'd prefer it if we did, and please, no. Let's just, uh, oh. Thank you for the letters, I guess. Thank you for those sweet, sweet notes. Oh, I was going to, I wanted to read the, oh. Hi. These are, so is she slowly remembering? There's so many letters. Must have pocket mirror, must set free, must have, oh, how many of these has she written? Poor Lisette, how crazy has she gone? Lisette, wait! Oh, no. So is it is it upside down to show that Lisette is a part of me? What the hell is this? Lisette, wait, why am I walking on them doors? 
Ooh, pretty music. Well, might as well continue around. Nothing's gonna pop out at me, clearly. On that fateful night, I gained everything and lost everything. Oh, well, thank you for these notes that you're leaving all conveniently for me. Let's what is this? What? Why is this? Is that a lamp following me? Let's read the note. I want to read the note. I believe this sacrifice of mine has benefited you, my dear. What does it say? Does it say Von Elise? That's what it says at the top. Von Elise. I don't know who Von Elise is. Is that her mother? Or is that part of... Is that her? Or... I exchanged my most beloved one for a dubious promise. One which has uh, deprived you of your freedom. Oh, wait. So I exchanged my most... This this can't, this has to be somebody of her family. Her father or her mother. I'm going to guess her mother. Because it's her father, her brother, and her mother. And there's only one other female in that. And so I think she's talking... So she exchanged her most beloved one. Interesting. Is this getting into the weirdness that was the secret being that took my name? Oh, my dear children, how I regret the sacrifice of mine. Wait, wait is this the old wax records? They seem to, like, see, they seem familiar. Are, is this the complete version of the old wax records? Hello, Lisette! Tell me where I'm going! Hi, how you doing? We caught up, can you turn around? Lisette, wait! Oh, she doesn't look happy. Oh, no. Oh, wait, I do Did I really that fucking die? Did I really just fucking die? Okay, no, this is not the game over screen. Right? I will be sad if this is dead. Or is this a secret? Is this a, is this a bad ending? Oh, no, good, I'm alive. I'm just floating in eternal darkness. What is this, Alan Wake? It's not an... It's not a lake. It's an ocean. Uh... Hidden away in the forest depths. I exchanged your name with a certain someone. Yes! Backstory, yes! What, who? Who, did you give my name to a demon? Did you give it to a fae? Don't trust the fae, kids. For a single chance at happiness. All I can ask is now your forgiveness and to please. I heard the save sound. Oh, did she open her pocket mirror? Do not ever let it go. Do you understand? Oh, this is so neat. This is the opening. Oh. This is the opening scene with her sinking into darkness. Oh. Yes, I understand. Oh, I understand. We've come full circle. How long have I been drifting here in darkness? The darkness of my own mind. Oh. So somebody traded my name away for their own happiness. And I guess in, in trading my name, they also traded my entire soul. That's how it works sometimes. Hello. Hi, everyone. Oh, this is so neat. I am in water, and I can move very, very slowly. I am going to just save right here. What is this place called? I'm curious. The Midnight Circus. Ooh. The, the music's kind of changed to something a bit more upbeat, like... Okay, apparently it's not that upbeat. I, I was imagining it. Are you gonna jump scare me there on the left, good sir? Are you gonna appear- something gonna appear in that cage? No? Really? Really? No jump scares? Oh! I could get used to this. I could get- I could get really used to this. Like, not having to worry about anything trying to scare me or anything. This is actually fairly nice. It's kind of pleasant, even. I do wish I could move a little bit fast. Oh, I can sprint. Just slightly. Midnight Circus. Might as well progress in word. Hi. Oh, who is that in there? Is that... Who is that? Who's in there? Is that Lisette in there? That looks like it might be Lisette inside of there. Oh, there are Lisettes everywhere! Lisettes in a cage! Ah, oh, that's convenient. Oh, God. Can you not whisper at me, good friends? I would appreciate it. A circus. She's here! The trit is here! How could she? Hey, can you... Can you not talk bad about me, Lisette clones? Fuck off! What's going on? Hey, don't you throw your tomatoes at me! I ain't no just a fool. Okay, you know, screw you guys. Unless those tomatoes explode on impact with my hair, because that would be bad. No, stop. Come on, you can handle this. Is it that? It's that kid, isn't it? Hello. Did you steal my name? Did you bring me here? Did you wake me up? And now you're giving a theater on me? Get out of here. Why isn't this the most glorious of spectacles? <laughs> yeah, you laugh at me. It's you again. You are really way too into this. Indeed, but who might I be? 
I think you're like some little demon phage of silence. Okay, okay, jeez, you gotta be so rude. Do you have a name? Impertinent munters. I don't know what munter is. I do not know what a munter is. Anyhow, congratulations. Thank you for the confetti, I appreciate that. You haven't gotten any smarter, have you? Oh, jeez. Oh, hey, do we get a puppet show? The time has come for you to give me what's mine, Missy. Oh, I'm getting quite tired of waiting, you see. Did he not get my name? Did he not get my name? Am I protecting my name? Is that why all of this is happening? Has it been an elaborate escape mechanism? Is that why my personality is split? Is that why everything? Am I protecting myself from him getting my name? That would be awesome. I'm getting tired of waiting, you see. Oh, jeez. You still don't understand, do you? No, I just don't. It's no use denying it now that you found the truth. Yeah. Let us leave you to your own demons now, shall we? Excuse me that he's a demon. Look at those horns. How can he not be a demon? Let the show begin. Are you gonna... Okay, that's a bit of a delay. I had a whole dramatic thing. Oh, man. Time for Lisette's theater. Oh, hi, Lisette. Oh, you are dismembered, girl. You are a girl in a box. Whoa, this is really neat. It's like pseudo 3D. Oh, I like it. Lisette something doll. Oh, Lisette, Lisette play doll. Is that why everything is like a clone, an empty clone? Because she... Is this like side of the personality, assuming that that's correct, um, named after a play doll that the protagonist used to have? I have to imagine this, the, her, a split personality, a multiple personality is the only thing that really makes sense here. Hello? What's happening? So was that the protagonist and Jell and Lisette there? Because she, the protagonist was crying, but oh god, hi Lisette. Oh, you look so sad. You look so distraught. I like how there's no text here thus far. Maybe they'll add it later. Oh. This is amazing. Oh, it's so thick. The camera shake and the pseudo 3D aspects. Oh, wait, is, is, is her going through a circus? A crown of thorns. She's being crucified. Oh. I see. I've got it. Oh, I finally get it. She's the scapegoat! Lisette's the scapegoat personality! Oh! She's the one that takes the blame for every terrible thing that the main character does. She's the personality that runs crazy. They talked about a demon child in the uh, in the room, and I assumed that was because she was being the protagonist was being uh, possessed. But I think it's because she put everything that was wild and crazy and disruptive into Lisette, and it showed Lisette being crucified on a cross, having a ring of thorns. That that uh that biblical imagery she's a scapegoat she's basically being crucified by everything for the sins of the protagonist she's she's the one that gets blamed for everything in this en entire like inner dynamic of the protagonist's mind she's the personality linked with being disruptive and crazy oh that's so interesting Oh, I understand now. I understand why Lisette hates the protagonist. The protagonist gets away with being good and being kind in this this t like this mentality of she's the goody two shoes. She that's why Lisette calls her the goody two shoes. It all makes sense. What are you doing here, Lisette? Listen. Aww. Oh well, well, look who's here. Get out. Getting angry, are we? <laughs> I thought he was hurt for a second, and then apparently decided to troll us. It was a pleasure to see you again, Lisette. Lisette. Lisette, listen, I have to tell you. Oh, she does not look happy. What are you doing here? I came to find you. I was looking for you. 
You're going to kill me, aren't you? <laughs> Looking for me, you say? Lisette, please, I need you to let li Lisette, Lisette, Lisette. Everything's always about Lisette, isn't it? I know. And what is it that you know, huh? Took a peek into Lisette's little horror show, and now what? No, that's not it. Lisette, that's not what I... I don't need your pity. Oh, can you not turn the world red? I really appreciate it. Oh, it's not pity. I don't need you. Can you not be all creepy, Lisette? I'd really pre- Oh, stop that scissor throwing. I don't need your petty pocket mirror. Lisette, I don't need it. Please don't- Oh, no. Lisette, no, please stop. Accept, protect? Accept or protect? Oh, wow. Except, oh my god, I have no clue. Protect? <laughs> what did I do? Whoa, whoa, am I shattering? Lisette. Lisette, I'm shattering. Oh, I made the entirely wrong choice. Oh, goodbye, protagonist friend. Oh, look at this. I want you to see it. Lisette, look at it. Inside of the protagonist's shattering mirror, you see Fleeta and Harpe. Oh, showing that they're all just different parts. I shattered. That sucks. I did it. I broke it. I'm free. And she's shattering as well. Oh, did I make a terrible mistake? I did. That was an interesting mistake, though. Wow. Wow. That was cool. Okay. Oh, I gotta collect myself. I'm going to go work my way back to the correct choice. And hopefully we can proceed from there. All right, here we go again. Let's hit accept this time. Oh, we ate the scissors. Oh, poor girl. If I die again, I'm gonna be pissed. Oh, I'm alive. Hi, pocket mirror. Thank you, Deus Ex pocket mirror. Oh, Fleeta, is that her brother? Oh, oh, here we go, here we go. There's a demon and it was that going to the protagonist or Harpe? Oh, that was really difficult to see. So is, is she getting her memories back? Lisette! Oh, Lisette looks actually pretty okay now. I never meant to hurt you. Ugh. Lisette, I'm sorry. Lisette always, like, that darkness around her is not a natural shadow. Like, that is something very strange. It's like almost like a plague on her face. Like, there is something... I almost feel like because everybody else has very natural shadows when they go, like, full-on creepy, and Lisette seems, like, purposefully plagued by something exterior. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for the tomatoes, guys. I appreciate... I'm having a moment here. Lisette ran away. She kind of stabbed me, I guess. I'm less stabbed now than I was two minutes ago, so that's good. Lisette. Oh, man. Where is she? Hello, over here? I guess I just have to press on. I probably could have gotten some pumpkin charms in there. It wouldn't even surprise me. Oh, finally, a save point past the theater. So let's put it right there. Where are we now? Where are we now? Let's see where we are now. We are in the Sub Rosa. The Sub Rosa. I don't know how... Whoa, what? There's nothing but whispers in these depths. Nothing but Lisette. Um, I don't know how Lisette doesn't need... Oh, rude. I don't know how far along we are. I feel like we're getting close. We're, we saw Lisette's theater, which means we have to be getting close to the end of Lisette's route, and I kind of want to do that. It wasn't Lisette. Lisette promised you it wasn't her. Whatever. She's going crazy. I know it wasn't you. Aw, everybody's going crazy. Oh, that's a shame. It's always a shame. Lisette, we didn't mean to piss you off. Stop that creepiness. There haven't been pumpkins for a while. Hi, Lisette. Are these all fake pocket mirrors? That's what they kind of look- Oh, I was saying there hadn't been pumpkins, but that pumpkin very much is smashed. Because, you know, she's part of smashing pumpkins. I love that. You. Can you not kill me? Oh, hi. Time to run, time to run, time to run, time to run, time to run. You know, let's just go, let's just go. Apparently she's not very happy with me. Where do I go after this? Where do I go? Oh, left, 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 left. Just keep going, just keep go- Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Up, 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 up. Oh, where do I go? Where do I go? Oh, God. Oh, God. They're so close to me. They are so close on. This is like the previous chase of madness. Of straight up madness. Liquid hot madness. Lisette, can you not stab me? I would appreciate it. Oh, she's gone. <coughs> I appreciate that she did not kill me. Lisette. Oh, her Lisette's chase scenes scare me ever since that first one. I just want to help me? 
No? Yes! Wait, what? Help me, no or yes. Is this like an ending choice or... I like the way that they framed Lisette's questions really interestingly instead of dialogue choices because she's not willing to talk to us. Help me, yes or no. Oh, I can go a direction. You know, let's help her. Let us help her. I don't know what, what this will do for us, but let's do it. Let us help her. Uh, hello? Did that, did that do anything for us? Oh, apparently not. Apparently, this is not the correct way to go. Hello, if I go back. What if I tap on it? What if I jump around? Jump up and up and get down. Did that do anything? Okay, we teleport. We are on a cross. We are on a cross. It says, oh god, whoa, whoa. Can you not chain me with your demon cross? I can't move. Oh, I should have seen that coming. Hi, said. Oh, hi. Oh, can you not? Oh, boy. Can you stop it with the eyes? I really appreciate it if you didn't. Oh, you just, okay, so, thank you, goodbye. It was nice seeing you again. Appreciate it. What, what is this? Why are there glasses? But and aren't these chains rather uncomfortable, friend? What? Was that really necessary? Oh! Wait a second, oh, ow. I had an idea, but I lost it. Can you not choke me? I'd prefer it if you did. Oh, I'm not, bye. It was nice knowing you. Bye, protagonist. I guess that's the end of our journey. What is Lisette worth to you? Oh, that's the protagonist it looks like. But there's arms. Wait, what? Is that me? Lisette is... She's what? So I was watching my own demise. I want to understand her. That's true, she's been pretty incomprehensible thus far. We, it's all her fault, it's something, it's, don't you make yourself, you don't you hate yourself now, right? Is this but the less set's responsibility? Uh, there's stuff, oh, she's, she's understanding her. She's getting to understand her. Okay, can I, do I walk into that mouth? Do I go up right up into that mouth? That would be, oh, creepy, oh, please don't. Thank you for your whispers, Lisette. Are these all the things she's wanted to say? To the protagonist. Oh god. Why is it all sucky? Why are the why are the sounds all whoa? Can you fucking not? Can you just not oh it's all gooey and weird in here. It's really weird in here. I don't like it. I don't like it. Thank you for cleaving out a path for me, I guess. Oh, this place is weird. Lisette, what is going on in your crazy weird mind of stuff? Hi, let's press on. It's too small, I can't get through. Crawl through. A strong bright light emanates through the gap with a sharp yet faded glow. Okay, let's do this the old-fashioned way. Let's pocket mirror it up. Hopefully, Lisette won't steal it whenever we're trying to find it. Um, or, oh, or do I scissor it up? Do I scissor? The mirror, my only something, my, that mirror, my, mo curse? I don't know what these are all saying. I'm going to get, I'm going to set my free. Lisette, you don't have to do any of this. A strong but bright light. Oh, hey, it's a note. Hey, thanks. Hi, Lisette. Thanks for the note. My only choice is to shatter you. There is nothing I yearn for the, mo the most than your love. I have to stop her. Oh, wait, so she's... Well, okay, so she wants to shatter me, but... Hello, magical door. It's really convenient how I have the ability to go through everything. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, this is already so pretty. Oh, endless notes in a blood red tree. Notes that she wanted to say to me. I imagine that's the thing. Like, I want to understand Lisette, but I think at the same time, she wants me to understand her, if that makes sense. She wants to be able to communicate with me in a real way. But I don't know if she can. She's unable to express it. This is a very strange, holy choir that we have here. Why are... Why are we entering the gates of heaven? Whoa, whoa, hey, 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 you! Was that Angel? Was that Angel? Oh, thanks for hanging me. I thought that was Angel chilling in the in the window, but apparently no, they just like to hang me. Ah, thanks for that, I appreciate that. You know, you've got some real creativity. It's not like I haven't been hanged in this game before. Why is my grave here? Can you not? Is that Lisette up there? It's so bright, it's hard to tell. Is that Lisette up there chilling with my coffin? Do I, if I stick, oh, hi. Oh, oh, 
Oh, church is in session. What's the mean? Bye. Lisette, we all came to church and you got to, oh God, oh. Oh, were there spikes in there? Lisette, are you there? Oh, can we not? Oh God, bye. Goodbye, oh, that was her hand. This is weird. This is weird. Hi, Lisette. How are you? Is your face? Yep, that's what I thought would happen. Oh, it is so loud. Oh. Did she just attack on Titan me? That's not cool. Oh, good, I'm alive. You know, our protagonist girl has been very resilient with a bunch of things that would normally kill her. She's been able to survive quite a bit up to now. Like everybody else, they kind of killed her and sort of, like, Fleeta kicked her down some stairs. But this, this, like, this, the set has been going all out and she still hasn't kicked it. Oh, this is such a weird room. I thought I was getting close to the end of her world, and she said, Lisette, are you there? I thought that was the case. I must have been wrong. So the previous save was called Crimson Queen. What is this save? Is it something terrible? Dull glass. Oh, well, that's actually remar- God damn it, don't do that to me. Yeah, I broke the mirror. Fine, I have to find her. Yeah, thanks for that, Lisette. Oh, no, it's a- I'm done. I'm done for now. I don't want to go around with crazy Lissettes lurking in the darkness around with mirrors and everything. Like, that is so reminiscent of the creepy beginning of Chase scene with all the mirrors. Anyways, I'm going to leave this episode here. I thought we would be getting to the end of Lissette's world. I don't know how close we are, but it looks like things are going to get a lot worse before they get better. But anyways, this has been Pocket Mirror. Will you stop it with the crunching of the papers? This has been Pocket Mirror. Thank you, everybody, for watching. If you like this video, please hit that like button, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Valian out. Oh no! Why does why does Red have a horse with the tent? What? Friend, no. I need that half. Here, I want you to have my old piston rod. I don't want Willie's rod. I don't want his old rod. I think we can all agree that Lisette is probably the most unstable of the girls that we've encountered yet. I think it's a fair assessment.